what's up guys we back with another one today is going to be something different uh today i'm going to be unboxing which i got right here a uh, sponsorship by max speeding rods this company uh contact me uh wanted me to give a shot of their products um they do got a lot of nice products i went over their website and this is actually a company i never heard of before but uh, after I started doing some research and searching through their web, they got a lot of cool stuff. Uh, this website, I've seen carry from turbos to lowing, coiling, uh, coilovers, level kits to a lot, a lot of stuff. We're gonna be unboxing. We're gonna do a review about this, an honest review. Um, let's see what my take is on, on this. I am gonna I am gonna be installing this kit onto my 2014 Sierra lifted Sierra. Uh, just got a lift, but I did want this uh, lift leveling kit. It's a leveling kit here. Um, I did want this on my truck. I was gonna purchase one uh, just because I'm gonna be doing when I do do some towing. I don't want it to squat. I know a lot of the lifted trucks they squat, um, and that's one thing a leveling kit could help out on it squatting i haven't even opened it but uh i'm gonna put you guys on a tripod we're gonna go over this we're gonna check out all the parts everything it comes with give an honest review all right guys let's open it up see what we got all right first thing is i see all the fittings bolts airline fittings this is nice this is good for airline hose you put the airline hose through here and then it, it cuts it perfect so this is a cool thing that they uh offer with the kit instead of um trying to cut it with the with the knife i know a lot of times people try to cut airline here's the airline right here but a lot of people would just take a knife to it and cut it bends sometimes it bends a lot of the edges there and i know from experience because i do install air ride suspension but this little tool right here makes a difference so this is a plus right there and like i said just comes with your fittings your brackets here for your uh, axle and i do see everything is quarter inch airline they'll say uh, aftermarket parts 100 percent brand new aftermarket parts this is a little label you do have some brackets nice uh it's metallic i'll uh, i'll end up uh color matching these to my truck the metallic the burgundy metallic just so it doesn't look off i do have color match suspension on my truck i did color match it all before it was installed so we got some nice bags half inch which is real good i like putting half inch on all my air suspension parts bags uh, everything uh, from the valves and all that this is a manual air kit for the back so it is going to come with a T and a inlet to air it up so i would just get my air compressor and air it up now i could since i do have this kit i could put a power i could put a air tank three three gallon air tank uh nothing too big two or three gallon air tank with a small compressor, two small valves, and I could make it to where I could just air it up from the inside of my truck if I decide to. But uh, looking from these bags, they look they look pretty good. Like I said, the bags do look good quality, but we're gonna put them to the test. Like I said, I am gonna be installing this and making my review after I do, do, do some towing and see what they're all about. Just got some more plates, bag mounts, um they do wrap over the axle and the leaf spring and we do got some some u-bolts that are covered in some kind of dust i don't know if that's rust or what but you can see last but not least is the airline quarter inch airline is fine you could run a lot bigger airline you just have to swap out your fittings 
which is this one here plugs in here and it's just a push feeding pulls right out this goes to the bag like that same to the other side gets mounted on your bracket so it's a simple little setup like I said it's a manual it's a manual uh, setup so nothing too fancy but actually like I said if I don't want to go out there and manually air it up I can put a small little tank to it and then just hit the switch uh, for the compressor to fill up the tank and raise it up I'm hoping all the hardware is here looks like it here's this what I'm talking about and it just has the, the regular cover here just like a tire you just put your air compressor hose here and raise it up that's what feeds the bags heat shields these go wrap around the bag with these and it just protects the exhaust from being too close to it and heating up the bags and then you, you cause your uh, tears. Like I said, I was gonna end up buying one. Uh, this company did reach out to me. Like I said, Max Feeding Rods. Uh, if you guys wanna check out their website, check it out. Doesn't hurt to look. They do got a lot of cool stuff. Uh, you guys that are into turbos on your trucks, hit them up. They do have a lot of turbo parts. But uh, that's gonna be it for this review, this unboxing. Let me know if you did check out the website, what you think about it. All right, we got the kit installing on the Sierra. Got the bottom plate in with the bag. We're working on the other side now. Here's the airbag from the top. What's up guys we back we're tra trailering the OBS back to Colorado Springs for the customer quick pit stop getting some fuel back on the road Alright guys, we made it. Colorado Springs, drop off the truck. Back to rear.